Good morning. Happy Saturday. It is currently, don't know, 10 something. <clears throat> 10, 16 and 40 seconds. That's because my computer tells me the seconds. But anyway, I was like, oh, let me get out my camera. Let me vlog. I'm about to go to Fort Worth. I'm going to go to the camera store, Fort Worth camera. I think that's what it's called. Because I really am looking to get some new camera equipment. If you do not know, I do photography. I have not done photography all year so far. Um, photography for me, I started back in 2016. But let me backstory that. I've always loved pictures. I mean, for Christmas, I've asked for digital cameras. Um, whether you have a cell phone. Like, I was always taking the pictures and I was always in a picture. I like both, okay? Um, 2014, I was a senior in high school. I did my senior project on photography. Um, so the mentor that I had for that, two years later, ended up selling me her Canon camera. It was a T2i. And in 2016, I started taking pictures. And I was like, eh, I don't want to make a business out of it. I don't want to do that. But people started wanting to book. So you gonna give me your money. Yeah, I got you. So, um, yeah, that's what happened. I'm, I'm... So I keep looking into the camera because I think I'm looking at you, but it be tricky. So I would just go with it. If, I, if I'm not looking at you, I'm sorry. I ain't trying to like not make this personal, but I'm trying to figure this thing out. So anyway, I'm going to the camera store to see. Mm, currently I shoot with the Canon 60D. I think I've had that for probably about two years now. No, 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 maybe three. I'm gonna have to look it up. But anyway, so I really need some, I really need some more lenses, if anything, because I do want to maximize my body. And I know that uh, it's a lot. I've been trying to look at this thing, trying to see, okay, do I need a new body? Do I need a new camera? What do I need to do? And I'm just trying to figure it out. So I'm about to go to the camera store and just play with some stuff and just to see which can, which um, brand of camera I like. Cause I really love Canon, but you know, I'm open for change if I have to, you know what I'm saying? So there's that. So yeah. I be forgetting to record. I need to do better, but I'm at Fort Worth camera. It's a nice big facility. Um, Y'all, I do not know all the technical terms of <laughs> photography stuff. So I be feeling a little slow. But I'm trying to get better. So, yeah, I'm here. And just getting information about stuff so I can get better. You only get better by asking questions and being willing to learn and being open for new things. So, there's that. 85 millimeter. Yeah. I like this. I like new equipment. It makes me feel like new. And I like this. I just like how it is, how it works. Gosh, it's just so nice. I like this stuff. Okay, yeah, no, I like it. Yeah. Okay, I'm leaving this photography store. Very helpful. I got some clarification as to what I'm really looking for and what I really want to get into. So, I just got to, you know, prepare a plan, make some decisions. Because... I learned that I don't need to buy a bunch of lenses for my current camera body if I'm about to upgrade. Otherwise, I would need an adapter. So I need to just start preparing to get. I just need to prepare for new, like what? 
I'm like, whatever I want, I need to prepare for. And I need to learn it, get the information, research, whatever. Like, I just need to get myself together. If I'm trying to go next level, I need to act next level and do next level things. That's the word for you. So, Fort Worth was about 40 minutes. Why do I say this song? Fort Worth was about 40 minutes from my house. So I'm going to hang out in this area for a little bit just because I didn't drive all the way out here just to go to one store. Probably going to go find me a Ross because you know that's my jam. Is this chicken and waffle place I saw on Instagram that was in Fort Worth? So I'm going to see, going to, I'm going to see how far that is from where I am because I am a little hungry. So yeah. Okay, I had to move that thing. It just wasn't working right, and I can't hold my phone. <sighs> I can't hold my phone while I'm trying to drive. But anyway, <sighs> it's hot. It's hot. I need to get that air going. <sighs> okay. to find the chicken waffle place then i'm gonna see how far it is okay so the place is called taste and see so i'm going to hit it eleven minutes i'm gonna go taste and see <laughs> looking forward to this just because um i had looked up the place because I, I saw it on um instagram actually i follow b and marka aka marka evans aka marka callahan because she's married now and about to be a whole mom out here but i follow her on instagram um and she has a food highlight on her instagram and i knew that she was in the area so i was like mm, let me see because i felt like she might have some you know um helpful tips and the chicken and waffles look At good stop now turn right onto montgomery street it was a long time ago so i'm hoping like this place you know ain't shut down and stuff from covid and all that good stuff not good stuff because i mean that would be good but i'm hoping that it's still here quarters of a mile turn left onto west freeway because i really want to taste and see <laughs> i'm really hungry Go so when i had light. then at the next one turn left i love that they do that now because siri had to know that she used to be confusing me sometimes because she'd be like turn right but it wouldn't be time to turn just yet so i like that she'd be like go past this light not yet but you're about to turn i like that Ooh. at the light turn left onto west freeway i was still i was in a good spot i thought i didn't know i was already turning let me tell you driving is something and driving in a big city is even more something in half a mile, take a slight right turn onto South University Drive. I didn't have these problems in Mississippi simply because the highways just weren't that big and stuff like that, and the traffic wasn't just too much. Honey, stay today, in the right two lanes. I like she said that too. Stay in the right two lanes. Thank you because I was definitely six lanes over take in the left. Take a slight right turn onto South. <laughs> Drive. Apple know what they doing, making it way more easy and feasible because they know we was out here confusing these streets, literally in the streets, because we were driving on the street. Ah, <laughs> crack myself up. I used to really be in college, wow, and I'm really not in college anymore. I just I see a a college billboard, and it looks like it's part of the campus or something i don't know i just really graduated and i'm really an adult out here in these streets wow that shack wings sunday wing deal half price what i wish it was sunday stop love some wings and sign me your cookies mm. I'm, I might have to give me some of them today. 
Not if I get chicken and waffles. If I get chicken and waffles, maybe not because that's third. But if I don't, I did not see. Maybe I was just riding too fast and I can't see, but I'm looking at it. I I'm not close enough to see if they're open. I can't tell. <laughs> I cannot tell. And I can't tell if I'm supposed to be parking here either. Let me make sure it's okay. Because I am not familiar. Honestly, y'all, I, I don't know. I don't think this is the place anymore. <laughs> Okay, something is telling me that the place that I'm looking for is no longer a place. I, I'm not gonna make no assumptions until I know for sure. But if you can hear the sound and tone in my voice, I'm feeling like I already know what the answer is gonna be. Dumb blonde smart hair. Yeah, I don't think there's a thing. <laughs> Darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Yeah, I'm looking in the window. Ain't nothing up in that place. Oh, I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Something told me that when I was looked, like when I was even considering it, that it wasn't, I, I just felt it. The Holy Spirit be speaking to me. I just need to trust. I just need to trust. I need to trust the voice. I went to insomnia, right? Insomnia, whatever it's called. And so there was hair in my bag. So he gave me an extra cookie. <laughs> well, not that I need an extra cookie. So I asked him about the taste and see. Um, I uh, hold on. Uh, let me show. So anyway, I asked him about the Taste and See place and he was like, they closed last year, like right before the pandemic, they weren't doing so well. And he said it was good, but it wasn't like a place he'd go back to. So 
I guess my mom could put it on her story. It just looked really, really good. But I think that was also a little while ago. So hmm. I'm glad I didn't drive out here like just to eat there. Like I'm glad I drove out here for a purpose because I would have been hot. Okay. But yeah, I need to find me something to eat because I'm hungry. Y'all, I smashed them insomnia cookies. Probably shouldn't have eaten all of them. I ate every single last one of them. Well, not every single last one, but it was so good. My favorite was the peanut butter. So good. It was warm, just right. Now I'm at this Ross and the parking here is outrageous. I really thought I was about to give me a park, but I played myself. Is a bunch of people out here. And I need a parking spot. I need a parking spot. And it's looking like they're not coming out this park. I saw them get in a car. So I assumed they were coming. <laughs> did I play myself again? I don't, I don't know. Maybe I did, cause they're not moving. I'm gonna just sit here for a little bit though. I need to park. I mean, I can't get out the car anyway, so I might as well just wait. Oh, but looky, 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 someone else just came out and I'm right in the right spot still. So I'm still about to get me a part. So there is that on that. It's very hectic in this area, very crowded. And it's a lot of people and the Lord still delivered. I know that this raw is about to be thick. It's probably gonna be really packed. Every Ross that I go to in Dallas is filled with people. So, it's probably gonna be packed. Okay, this is a different looking Ross. They got the DJ out. Hello. Hi. Okay, it's really actually not as packed as I thought it was gonna be. I'm not really looking for anything in particular. But when I come to Ross, I do like to look at the shoes because you just never know what you you might find. I do like to look at the house supplies because obviously I'm in that space now where I be needing stuff. And sometimes I'll look at the clothes, but some lately my patience for trying to find something has been a little slim. I just, I don't know. I just, I don't be feeling like looking. I just don't. But anyway. So I didn't realize that the Ross I was walking into led me to like a mall type thing. I'm guessing it's a mall. I mean, it looks like a It's a big old establishment. I didn't know why the parking was so crazy and packed. So. Yeah. Okay, well, that was what it was while it lasted. It's a lot of people. I realize I'm just not super fine of being around a bunch of different people. People don't be saying, excuse me, they be on your back. They be about to run into you. And the Lord tests my salvation every single time. I still haven't got anything to eat. I did buy two shirts from Ross. And I'm about to get, I 
out of this area. I'm tempted to go to another Ross because I just, I really enjoy doing that. So, yeah. That was a lot. Yeah, that was a lot. It's currently 2.08. I don't want to be out all day, so I'm, I need to go. I always do this. I need to go ahead and wrap this up. So, yeah. So I had got my nails done last Saturday. They're already peeling, and it's been a week, but they started peeling like Tuesday. I do not like going to um, Vietnamese nail shops. And I say that because most of them are Vietnamese, the ones that I go to. I do not like going to their nail shops because I feel like when I try to tell them something I don't like, I feel like they don't listen. They listen to cut you off and tell you what you need and what ain't right. And I don't like that. I don't like that. And when I was in Jackson, I stopped going to them because one of the shops that I was going to for like four years really irritated me and they didn't care. They were very rude. And I was like, I'm not going back. I ain't been to that place since and won't go back. But I got my nails done because I'm getting my nails done for graduation. And I'm getting it by a black nail tech. Thank you, because I love them. But I was trying to get them done because I didn't want my nail, real nails to break. So I got them done so that I could have something, some protection. Well, they ain't protecting. So there's that. somebody that was blind using a stick and that just god that just hurt my feelings because it hurt my feelings but it also made me really really grateful just now like gosh i can see i'm literally driving right now because i have sight thank you god oh lord oh jesus you ever had those moments where you just be like man i'm so blessed don't deserve it. Ain't obligated to have it, but God still be looking out for me. I appreciate that. Okay, so when I came over here, it was a Walmart. It's a Marshalls. It's a Ross. It's a Route 21. It's a Hibbits. And it's a Shoe Carnival. My plan is to go on all of those places. I have to return something to Walmart. So that's why I'm going to Walmart. And panda express is over there and i haven't had it in a long time when i had it it wasn't that good but because i'm hungry and i am familiar with that i'm gonna try it and i'm gonna hope for the best so yeah that's the plan that's the plan okay so i did my return at walmart i didn't go to panda express because i'm just not hungry enough for that right now and truth be told it's not really what i want but now I'm going to East Fashion Metro, which I just realized they had. I didn't see that they had East Fashion when I was when I first pulled in. So they be usually having. Thank you, thank you. They be usually having some good shoes in here. So I'm gonna see if I can buy some. I ain't been to East Fashion Metro in a minute, so I don't even know if they still call it Metro, cause. I don't see Metro nowhere. I just see it's fashion. So maybe either. Anyway. Well. That was fast. Because they didn't have anything. That I was interested in. So yeah. I'm about to go into Route 21. Mm. What they got. Hi. Don't look like they got anything either. <laughs> what is this?
I didn't last. That, that lasts for 30 seconds. So, oh, I need to go and hit this real quick. I'm looking for these Nike socks I like to get. I used, to, well, the, the packet that I get, they got, I got it at Ross a couple years ago. I ain't seen them ever since. My timing just gotta be off because the stores just don't got nothing I'm looking for. I'm about to go on Ross. After this, I'm about to head home because I'm ready to go. I don't wanna be out all day, like until the night. Okay, Ross didn't have anything that I really wanted. Neither did any of the stores I went to. I forgot to go and shoot Carnival. I really don't feel like going to shoe carnival, so I'm not. I'm about to go home. I'm ready to go home or to that back to that side of the town rather. I forgot there was a rainbow over here, so I'm going in there to look real quick. Cause usually sometimes well I said the same thing about his fashion, but they be having shoes and stuff. Let's just see if they have what I'm looking for. got some options but I really want a clear shoe so I'm gonna have to look into that online okay that's cute well look what I see when I come to this stop sign, it's my last name, 352. I'm finally at home. I'm sleepy. I think I'm going to take a nap. I'm so tired. Glad I made it home safely. Thank you, Lord. Okay, so it's 620 and I laid down for about two hours in about 15 minutes. I just got up because I'm hungry. I was trying to try Uber, Uber Eats because they had sent me a code. The code wasn't working. I'm not about to pay a bunch of money when I can go get the food myself. So, not even sure what I want to eat at this point because the place that I was going to eat at, I started looking at the reviews and it was a little mixed for me and I don't really want to take a chance. So, I just came and got in the car because I'm hungry. And I need to eat. So I haven't even eaten today. It's besides the smoothie that I told you I ate and then them cookies that I didn't eat, but whatever. So yeah, I'm not sure where I want to eat at. I really want to sit down somewhere, but I'm probably not going to do that. Okay. I got Chinese and I'm watching Jenny and Georgia. Did you, I never seen orange chicken this big. How to. It's so big. And I guess when you look on camera, it don't look as big, but it's big. But anyway, it's okay. I had got some crab ragoon because I really wanted some. I don't really like that. It's not what I remember tasting back then. And it probably is a little old. It tastes a little old. Like they ain't giving no fresh one, but it's all good. Every time I get a bad meal now, I just charge it to the game. It's like, okay. I took this L, but I ain't got to ever play again. Mm. Yeah. It's okay. But the food, five out of 10. Probably won't go back. <laughs>